Hello everybody, Surfman 1968, Delaware Digger, out here going to give it another shot. Uh, farm fields are all planted so we're going to hit a spot here that I have uh, worked um, with my uh, Xterra 70 that I had. I've hit it with my H250 and of course uh, cleaned it up pretty good with this Explorer SE Pro but we're going to give it another shot. I'm going to do something I haven't done yet with this Explorer. I've had this thing for two years almost and I've never turned deep on. So I'm going to turn on deep and uh, leave all my settings alone and just see what happens. But back here down this little hill, just beyond that pole, is an old soccer field. So we're going to, you know, see what we can pull out of that area. Just work on that for a couple hours. It's about 6 o'clock in the evening, Sunday. We've been out on the beach. It sucked out there on the beach. Horrible day on the beach. Uh, did get to see some old friends I hadn't seen in a while, so it was cool. Give a shout out to my friend Deb and her kids. Uh, but we're gonna um, we're gonna work it, and if I find something cool, I'll come back. Well, here's a second coin. I'm gonna try to get it in some light, and it's a wheat. Doubt you can see it. It's pretty nasty. But it is a wheat penny. Looks like a uh, 45. So there's a wheat. Always oh, cool. Be back if I get something else. Well, I'm back. I'm heading back to the car. And this is what I got. Not quite sure what it is. But it does say sterling in there. If you're gonna be able to see it or not, but I'll let her focus for a second. I don't know what it is, but uh, I guess it's some kind of a ring, or I mean, it, it's hard to say. Let's see if I can get a better look. I'll be right back. All right, I got it on macro mode now. Right in there it says sterling. There you go. Don't know what it is. I guess it's some kind of ring or something. I ain't dug much. I've just been going for deep iffy signals. And this one was down in there a little ways. And you can see how far down it was. And it came up uh, 0130, 0029, you know, 0130, stuff like that. So it's kind of, it's kind of weird. I guess it's a kid's ring or something. I don't know. It's small. It won't even hardly go on my pinky finger. But anyway, it's kind of cool. Not sure what the hell it is, but I don't know. Anyway, that's it for me today. See you later. Well, Surfman 1968, back out here again. This, uh, it's quite a bit uh, time has gone by between these hunts, but it's been hot and I ain't been out. I'm at the same place though. And this is my second target. My first target was a clad dime. And this is some kind of a ring. I don't know what yet. Pretty cool though. I'll have to clean it up and see what it is. But uh, it's got something on it. I don't know if this thing's going to be able to focus on it or not. But let me see if I can get a better look. I'll be right back. Well, you can see it's got something on it there. I don't know what that is. Looks like a genie bottle or something. But it does say sterling in there. Pretty cool. We ain't found that many rings out here. It's like the second one. Looks like it had a stone on it. Probably some cheesy fake deal, but I'm going to dig around the hole see if I can't find it. I'll be back. And I found it. And it was right there in the hole. And it's metal. And I didn't even have to use the uh, pinpointer to find it, but uh, I don't know. It says uh, Library Club on it. 
it doesn't look like it's going to focus in that that on that though there it is library club turn it around a little bit Joe library club how about that pretty cool all right man I'm back at it I'll be back well been a little while another fine it's a wheat it's a 1938 and it was shallow this uh this parking lot used to be an asphalt parking lot they tore it up so and I've never worked it I always let it be I might walk around here a little bit and see what I can pull out I'll be back well there's another wheat 37 this time and they aren't deep getting late so a little after 8 I'll stay for a little while longer be back if I get something else well I'm back out here again first target is a wheat no telling what the date is because it's all crusty on the face of it but it's definitely a wheat and that's the first target so that's cool I'll be back well dug some junk and a memorial but I got another Another wheat. Gets a 44 D. Hoping that's not all I found out here. You know, you would think there'd be some shallow silver. A lot of this is shallow. Down about seven or eight inches. It's pretty solid where they filled over. Where this used to be a parking lot. So this must be all coming from the fill. I don't. I don't know exactly, but another wheat. 44 D. Be back if I get something else. And it's another wheat. And it's a crusty one. But it is a wheat. Can just make it out. Of course, no date. I guess and that's all I'm going to find out here in this spot is wheat pennies. But hey, beats sitting around. Be back. Here we are back. And another wheat just there everywhere I found another one just a couple of minutes ago but it was so crusty I couldn't see for sure I'm pretty sure it's a wheat they're just everywhere I can't tell the date on it because the front of it's all crudded up it actually had a when I pulled the hole that right there came out so I thought huh that's all there is to that I just checked the hole again, and sure enough, there was a weed in it. <laughs> How about that? I'll be back. Back again. Here's something's pretty cool I just found. Hoping you guys can see that, that this camera will focus. There we go. It's pretty wild. It says, Grand Army of the Republic, 1861 to 1866, and it says Veteran on it. It's a little badge of some kind. Really cool though. I've never seen anything like it. Don't know what the hell it is. Some kind of cool badge though. That's pretty neat. I like that. Heck, I've never found anything like that. Pretty cool. Be back if I get something else. And you guessed it. Another wheat. Looks like a 37. Yep, 37. Still getting them though. Be back. Alright guys, been out here for a while. So out on the beach for a couple hours today and it threatened so we moved off and of course it never rained and I've been collecting wheats some of them just concreted over with crap but uh, I don't know if you can see that but finally finally I have found some silver and it's a Merc that is about time and it is a 1942 
this thing will focus. No mint mark. But there you go. Finally. Nice little Merc dime. Loving it. I'll probably make one more pass and I'm going to head to the car. Be back if I get something else, guys. Alright, everybody. I'm going to do a quick wrap up of this uh, video. Try to be real quick so it's not like a half hour long video. But I uh, found a bunch of wheat pennies. You can see how some of them, a few of them are just so crusted over. I mean, I. I don't exactly know that that's a wheat, but I'm pretty sure. My uh, my 42 mark. Here's that first ring I found. Don't even really know what it is. It says sterling. Here's that other one. This is a, a silver, sterling silver ring. And I glued the, uh, the little library club emblem onto it. Came out really nice. <clears throat> Can't really get any information out of it. Have no idea. Cool find though, but this is the 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 really good thing that I found, and it's a uh, turns out it's a Grand Army of the Republic um, badge that they issued to the members, and I googled it of course, and it was founded in uh, April 6, 1866. And membership was limited to honorably discharged veterans of the Union Army, Navy, Marine Corps, uh, corps or the uh, Revenue Cutter Service, who had served between April 12, 1861, and April 9, 1865. So pretty cool. Somebody, you know, somebody lost it. Somebody dropped it, but it's legit. They were made out of captured uh, Civil War uh, cannons, the bronze. But it's uh, the real deal. But anyway, I just thought I'd do a quick wrap up and show you guys what I found. Um, you know, this is over uh, three separate hunts at the same place, and. Uh, you know, all in all, a real good hunt. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Bye.